All right, so for our F-16A model, which is a static display, we are taking it from our static park here at Aviano Air Base, and then with our corrosion team, we are giving it a full repaint. So for our F-16 static, it is quite a lengthy process. So first, with our transient alert team, we had to take the static off of its mount, and then we had to tow it over to our corrosion facility, where first it goes through an aircraft wash, and then we sand it down to its primer, we go through every inch of the jet, and then we tow it over again to our painting facility where we have to give it a full paint and then apply every decal. So we actually technically have it on loan from the National Museum of the Air Force. All static aircraft um, in uh, the Air Force, that's all owned by the National Museum. And then us um, at the 31st Fighter Wing are just stewards um, of that aircraft. And so we have to make sure we're, we're taking care of it and so that we can report back to the National Museum. It's also that this is a symbol. The F-16 is, if you've spent any time at Aviano in the last 30 years, is the symbol of Aviano. So on the tail flash of the aircraft, um, we have three symbols. So we have our wyvern, which the wyvern is part of our emblem. Um, that, that emblem actually dates back to when we were a bombardment group and we've had it ever since then. The other two colors is we have the purple and the green. So the purple represents our 510th fighter squadron and then the green represents the 555th fighter squadron. We're fortunate that we have the F-16, um, we have the F-100 that sits right next to it that actually is an Italian aircraft that was flown by the Italians. And so I think what's neat is that that aircraft literally represents our, our NATO ally of the Italians and this shared base. The F-16 itself kind of represents um, that friendship um, between the Italians and the Americans and that we have to work together um, every day, like just like we did um, with this aircraft.